The Dark Story Bot has reached 100 followers. Thanks to all my darklings who support the channel. Disclaimer, this content may be disturbing for some viewers. Viewer discretion is advised. Welcome back to my world, where the darkness is always lurking. Today, I will be telling you the story of Daria Nikolaevna Saltykova, also known as Saltykika, one of the most notorious female serial killers in history. Daria Nikolaevna Saltykova was born in Moscow in 1730, into a noble and wealthy family. She was the daughter of Nikolai Saltykov, a high-ranking government official, and his wife, Anna Turchaninova. Saltykova was the second of three daughters and was known for her sharp wit and intelligence. At the age of 16, Saltykova was married off to her cousin, Alexei Saltykov, who was twice her age. The marriage was arranged by her father, who wanted to keep the family wealth and power within the Saltykov family. However, the marriage was not a happy one. Alexei was a heavy drinker and often abused Saltykova. After years of enduring her husband's abuse, Saltykova became more and more isolated and resentful. She began to take out her anger on her serfs, the people who worked on her estate. She would beat them, torture them, and even kill them without any remorse. In 1762, Saltykova's husband died, and she inherited his estate, making her one of the wealthiest landowners in Russia. With this newfound wealth and power, Saltykova's sadistic behavior escalated. Saltykova began to lure young peasant girls to her estate, promising them good wages and a better life. Once they arrived, she would torture and abuse them, often forcing them to work long hours with little food or rest. Saltykova would often beat the girls, burn them with hot irons, and even mutilate them. Saltykova's reign of terror continued for years, and she was able to get away with her crimes because of her status as a noblewoman. However, in 1764, a group of serfs and peasants from one of Saltykova's estates filed a complaint with the local authorities, accusing her of murder and torture. The authorities initially ignored the complaint, but when rumors of Saltykova's crimes began to spread, the case was reopened. Saltykova was arrested in 1767 and was charged with a murder of 139 people, although the actual number of victims is believed to be much higher. During her trial, Saltykova showed no remorse for her crimes and even boasted about her sadistic behavior. She was found guilty and sentenced to life imprisonment in a convent in Siberia. She spent the rest of her life there, living in isolation until her death in 1801. Saltykova's case is one of the most chilling in history, as it shows the extent of human depravity and cruelty. Her sadistic behavior and lack of empathy towards her victims are a stark reminder of the darkness that can lurk within us all. Today, Saltykova is remembered as one of the most notorious female serial killers in history, and her story has inspired several books and movies. Her legacy serves as a warning of the dangers of unchecked power and the consequences of giving in to our darkest impulses. Until next time, stay safe, and beware of the darkness that lurks in the shadows. I have some exciting news to share with you. As you know, I have been sharing some of the most spine-chilling true crime stories with you on TikTok. But did you know that I have also written a book on true crime? That's right. My book delves into some of the most fascinating and macabre stories from the world of true crime. It's filled with tales of murder, mystery, and mayhem that will keep you on the edge of your seat. By purchasing my book, you'll be supporting the Dark Stories But channel, allowing me to bring you even more sinister and bone-chilling stories. So, if you're a true crime aficionado, or just love a good scare, Head on over to my Instagram page and click on the link in my bio to get your hands on a copy of my book today. And don't forget to follow me on Instagram for even more true crime content and updates on future projects. Thank you for your support, my darklings. Until next time, stay safe, and beware of the darkness that lurks in the shadows.